Have you ever? <laughs> <clears throat> have you ever wanted a late night snack, like a little pizza? You're like, I want to go to Little Caesars, but that's too far. Like it's like midnight right now. You don't want to go to Little Caesars, and Papa John's is too far. And you think yeah. Papa Murphy's is the one, but you know you have to make your own pizza there, and it's like really expensive. So I have the yeah. perfect recipe for you. Welcome back to Miguel and Katie's cooking show, because today we will be cooking um, <laughs> homemade pizzas. Tortilla pizza. Thank you. Tortilla pizzas. So for this, you'll need tortillas, tomato sauce, pepperoni, Parmesan cheese, and shredded cheese. And you can also get some red crushed peppers. And obviously, mm -hmm. you'll need a toaster oven and a pan. So let's start baking. So you grab this tortilla. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, I'm like hogging the tomato sauce. Give me one yeah, second. Yeah, can I have the sauce? Katie, give me one moment. I feel pressured right now. <laughs> but anyways, now you spread it all on the tortilla. You add your cheese, sprinkle some cheese onto the tortilla. Just a generous amount, not too much, not too little. This is already looking absolutely amazing. But now we're gonna add pepperonis to the pizza, because you know, who doesn't love pepperoni pizza? The real question is, who likes pineapple on pizza, you know? My opinion, pineapple is definitely top, like five toppings on pizza. What's the next ingredient? <laughs> I'm opening the Parmesan cheese. Thank you, Katie. <laughs> and I'm handing it to Miguel. Thank you for the Parmesan cheese. You know, this is, a, once again, another great. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> okay. So you just want to sprinkle a generous amount of Parmesan cheese onto the pizza. This seems yep. like a lot of cheese to Katie. I love my cheese. Anyways, now that we're done with our pizza, this actually looks amazing. We're gonna put it onto the pan. But anyways, we're gonna put this into the toaster oven for eight minutes at 425 degrees. Whoa. How See did it? that get there? Wow. Just flew out of nowhere. Unicorns versus dragons, staff opinions. I personally think unicorns. Like, uh, people say, unicorns can't grant me wishes, but I personally think that. I think dragons are better. How are you gonna feed a dragon? Get food? They can fly. Okay. <laughs> they just have powers. Places? Like, how are you gonna get that much food to feed a dragon? You know, a unicorn is just a horse with powers. You, so you can, can have afford any that. dragon you want. But like, you can have any unicorn you want. I personally saw a unicorn on the way here. Like, I was actually driving here, and <laughs> like the first time, so I was gonna park, but someone's parked over the line. So I drove somewhere else, and that's when I saw a unicorn like flying in the distance. <laughs> you know, now that I think about it, what about all those characters for holidays, like Santa? Is he real? Do you know I actually saw Santa? Santa is actually related to me. Like he's my. So okay, so I have a brother. Uh huh. That brother has a friend. Uh huh. And that friend has a sister. That sister has a boyfriend whose younger brother. Yeah. Has a friend, and that friend has a nephew. Uh huh. Who saw Santa? So I think Santa's real. <laughs> what about his reindeer? You know. I don't believe in reindeer though. Like I think reindeer is just fake. You know, I think he just like flies around. But Santa's like... real. Yes. What about the Easter Bunny? The Easter Bunny's fake though. Mm. Dang. Okay guys, you can try the pizza, you know? Yep. It's made with perfection. What do you give it out of 10? Mm -hmm. I'd give it like a seven. Okay. Five. Wow, harsh. <laughs> Katie, what do you think about it? 
supposed to be a nice small girl. A nine. Okay. I think it's absolutely amazing. 11 out of 10, easily. I think it's a 10 out of 10. I want some more. 